Hey guys, uh, let's talk about landing gears for a second here. So because Space Engineers doesn't have a built-in boarding ramp or extending landing gear, people kind of come up with their own solutions. But the thing about piston, rotor, and hinge landing gear is that they are clangy and no one wants to like worry that their ship is gonna explode every time they open a boarding ramp on their ship. So what I'm gonna show you guys today is how I do my landing gears in a very cheap and non clangy way. So there's two types and this is the first type. This is the race static landing gear. So basically, I use a grate and then I use windows. Uh, you can replace the grate with windows, I mean with a window as well, and it will cost you seven girders because you don't even have to weld them and a race landing gear is good if you have stuff underneath your ship or at the bottom of your ship like turrets connector and stuff you can also extend it for as long as you want so for example if your ship is taller or wider you can always extend this and also like i said before they are very cheap so they are very expendable, they are easily replaceable. Now, the second type of static landing gear is just simply a bulge, like this. Uh, this type of landing gear is perfect if you don't have anything underneath your ship. Because that's pretty much all you need to balance the ship. Just a bulge like that. Now, you might think not attaching to the ground is a disadvantage, but actually it's not because the thing about having a landing gear is if you're locked to the ground and the landing gear is broken, you cannot unlock it unless you fix the landing gear or grind it. And that makes you more susceptible to ambush on the ground because if an enemy comes while you're locked to the ground and they damage your landing gear, you'll be stuck on the ground until you grind or fix the landing gear and that's never a good thing. Alright, so now let's talk about boarding ramps or ground entrance. This is how I usually do my ground entrance. So, a ground entrance is something that can be used when your engineer doesn't have a jetpack. Obviously, if you have jetpack or hydrogen, it's always easier to just go up, but just in case you run out of hydrogen, it's always a good thing to have a ground access thing. And the cheapest way you can do this is by using ladders. And something like this is usually sufficient. And you're on without needing jetpack or a complex rotor or hinge setup. The same is also true for my smaller ship here. I use the same method. And you can see it works just fine. So yeah, those are the types of static landing gears and ground entrance that you can make without using pistons, rotors, or hinges.